Two Southeast Texas school districts took their battle to the Jefferson County Commissioner's Court today to settle a dispute that has been months in the making. Bevel Oaks became a part of Hardin Jefferson ISD last year. As Jordan James reports, it ended the end of a long separation process from Beaumont ISD. We would like to be completely away from BISD, not still owing them tax dollars or anything like that. It's a million dollar question. How much money does Hardin Jefferson ISD owe Beaumont Independent School District for allowing Bevel Oaks to leave the district? We have to go before the commissioner's courts and have them make that determination. Since both districts were not able to come to an agreement, they had to appeal to a higher authority. In this case, that's the county. So lawyers from both districts made their case with Jefferson County. Our statute does not say you have to use values from fill in the blank here. We believe the, the annexation process used the 16 values that the commissioner would agree that that's the right number. Back in Bevel Oaks, city manager Kimberly Vanver says the court battles are nothing new for the city. Uh, Bevel Oaks is used to court battles. We've been in them for a while with BISD trying to get out of it. Signs like these are one of the few around the city. Vanver hopes that the people in the courtroom don't forget who the ruling impacts. Our citizens are still struggling and you know and they still need help whether it's in the form of a neighbor coming by and saying let me help you hang sheetrock or uh, let me pray for you. Well, 12 News has learned Beaumont ISD and Hardin Jefferson ISD reached a tentative agreement today. Attorneys are still working on the final language.